Now at 11, cannibalistic killings. We're seeing crime scene pictures from a horrific attack on a Florida couple. The Martin State Attorney's Office released the evidence in the case today, and the highly anticipated toxicology reports show the 19-year-old accused of the brutal murders of the, that Tequesta couple did not have flocka or bath salts in his system. CBS 4's Carrie Codd spent the evening pouring through the evidence, and we need to warn you, you may find some of these images and information disturbing. These are crime scene photos of suspected killer Austin Haroff after Martin County deputies finally subdued the man who displayed superhuman strength on August 15th. Haroff is accused of stabbing, beating, and taking bites out of the bodies of John and Michelle Stevens inside the garage of their home, and then resisting tasers and the efforts of deputies to stop him. This is a photo of the knife investigators believe Haroff used in the crime. It had hairs on it. We can show you these images taken by Martin County crime scene investigators after the killings as they trace the blood trail at the home. But the bulk of the crime scene photos released by prosecutors Wednesday are too grotesque for public view. We're learning that the FBI did not find flaca, bath salts, or cocaine in Haroff's system. They did find some marijuana and alcohol. We're also hearing from some of the emergency crews who responded to try and help the victims. One of them called Haroff the devil. Get down and quickly assess the, the uh, same like me, the devil. That EMT said Haroff said a few things at the crime scene. He was just coming up saying, F America, just kill me. The documents released contain a police interview with Haroff's mother and sister after the crime. Haroff's mother said her son was acting strangely that day, and she played an audio recording of her son. I'm, I become like almost immortal. I have to die. I have to die one day. Haroff's sister said her brother had recently spoken about having superpowers, and he struggled with insomnia. He, and he was talking about being immortal, running lights, being in front of cars. Testing his powers, being a half an animal. And some might argue as Haroff lay in handcuffs that night that he was. Haroff is being held at the Martin County Jail facing two counts of first degree murder. His attorney said in a statement Wednesday they did not think the FBI would find flaca or bath salts in his system. Instead, his attorneys believe Haroff suffers from severe mental illness and they plan to address those issues in court. In Stewart, Kerry Codd, CBS 4 News Tonight.